hello friends hello darling how are you doing today yes welcome back to my channel thank you thank you for joining me today um <laughs> yes in today's video i'm gonna rate and i don't have a lot of paris corner but the ones i have i'm gonna rate them for you today and yes the first one i'm gonna start with uh this one is new to my collection and um some people like it some people love this they enjoy this fragrance but for me i've tried to love it or try to enjoy it although i get compliments each time i wear it but i'm talking about myself i I'm trying okay <laughs> and the focus i'm talking about is um charuto tobacco vanilla this is the bottle this one i when i bought this fragrance at first i didn't like it and after macerating i've not um talked about after macerating i've not given feedback but in this video, I will briefly tell you what I get from it. After macerating, it's still the same. It didn't change a bit. It didn't change. This one is tobacco. That opening is tobacco. And the tobacco, to me, it kind of upsets my stomach. I feel like, you know, when you sniff something, you feel like puking that is what the tobacco in this fragrance does to my body i find it difficult to like tolerate it well the first 30 to 45 minutes i get the tobacco a lot of tobacco and after that then the vanilla start coming out for me i've tried it's 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 not giving for me it's a beautiful fragrance. I'm not going to say it's not, but I'm talking about myself. I try to, you know, enjoy this fragrance. I've given it a try over and over, even after macerating. I don't know. I don't know if I should still let it macerate. Yeah, I don't know if I should still let it macerate. But I'm not sure if it's going to change more than what it is already. I'm not sure. But I'll still give it another one month to masturbate. <laughs> I guess that's the best choice right now. I really want to try and enjoy it. With the way people talk about this fragrance, that it's good, it's this, is that. I kind of, is it the same thing that I'm sniffing? Is it the same fragrance or is different? Is it that this batch that I bought is like this? Or I don't know. I don't know it's it's strong for me the tobacco it's but the dry down is what i enjoy the vanilla that is what the vanilla start coming out if not this is just okay for me and because of that i'm gonna give this a six out of ten six out of ten because I enjoyed the dry down after like spraying it after for five thirty to forty five minutes of spraying of wearing it, the vanilla starts, you know, showing its presence. But that opening, I can't. It's uh, yeah, you know what I mean. Uh, and the second one that I'm gonna rate today is from oh, they're all from Paris Cologne. Is Vos Patisserie. This one, it's too sweet. Too sweet. Like, this one, I know it have tangerine. Yeah, it have tangerine. It have um saffron which is which made it spicy it's woody from the sandalwood 
But to me, it's just too sweet. Each time I sniff this fragrance, I, I get goosebumps. It's just too sweet to the extent it's kind of synthetic for me. It kind of reminds me, I'm not saying that the same now, it kind of reminds me with the synthetic vibe I'm getting from it. It kind of reminds me of Bade Outwood Amethyst. That one to me is synthetic. Another one that is still synthetic for me is by Ad Zafaran. Is it Ad Zafaran? Something. Oh, I can't remember. That one is coconutty. That one is way too sweet for me too. I'm going to leave the picture on the screen. Those two and this one, they give me the same vibe. It's too synthetic. But after maturating, I will tell you the only difference I get. That opening. When the when first I when I first got this fragrance, when I sprayed it, I could get it. The projection was like way too much. This is a very loud fragrance, very loud fragrance. But after maturating, if I say the opening is like six to seven feet projection, but now it's giving me like five to six feet projection. It kind of it's not as open as it used to be the first time I got it. After my rating, it's kind of mellowed a little bit, like tuned down a little bit. But it's still synthetic. It's sweet, too, way too sweet. But hours later, I enjoy it. After some time, I begin to enjoy it. But that opening is way too sugary for me, too sweet. It kind of gives me synthetic vibe. And because of that feeling, I'm not saying it's not a good fragrance, but to me, it's what I get, is how I feel about it. And because of that, I'm going to give this fragrance uh, 6.5. Yeah, 6.5 out of 10. And the next one, I don't have that one anymore, but I'm going to put it in here because I don't have a lot of Paris Corner. But I'm gonna throw that into this video. Uh, that one is from the house. It's, uh, that one is called um, Tuscan Caramel Cascade. That one to me is too milky. The lactose in it, it's too lactonic. It's too sweet. It's too creamy. Imagine caramel and milk as the opening. It's way too sweet for me and to um it kind of give me this kind of dusty vibe you know when you open um a dust yeah it's too dry and too creamy for me i love caramel but the milk in it is it's it's not giving. If it's just caramel with something else as opening, that I can tolerate. But caramel and milk is way too creamy and too dusty, too dry on me. And because of that feeling that I have for that fragrance, I've given that away. Um, because of the feeling I have for that fragrance, uh, the way I feel each time I sniff it, or I wear it. Not that I don't get compliments. I do. But the vibe I get from it. How I feel. I'm going to give that one a 6.5. Out of 10. 6.5. Out of 10. So the next I'm going to leave the picture on the screen. The next one. It's. Noof. Noof. One thing I love. I love the tassel. I don't enjoy the cap. I do not enjoy the cap. I just love the tassel. This is what I do when I'm holding this bottle. I just play with it. <laughs> this one to me, it's pineapple. You know when you bite into sweet ripe pineapple? Or some people that enjoy pineapple with lemon or lime or something, some citrus. That's taste of lime and citrus 
that's what this is giving me this one i think this one also have orange you have um they have bergamot i think you have lime or lemon i think lemon not lime lemon that is what this one give, gives me is kind of a little bit woody i would say it's a little bit woody yeah oh this one is sweet ripe pineapple with some hint of wood and citrus to it yeah i love this fragrance i enjoy it i'm gonna give this seven out of ten yeah seven out of ten <laughs> it's a beautiful fragrance and the next one is called kissa blue This one's another beautiful fragrance that I enjoy so much. This one, this one is citrusy. Yeah, this one is citrusy. This one have um, it have grape. Uh, no, it have lemon. This one have lemon, which I get. It have orange. It have some floral notes. Yeah, it has some floral notes and it kind of it's also musky and there's something that i'm getting that is a bit spicy in it the ginger i get that ginger yeah i get it this one is beautiful at first when i got it i loved it even after my reading i still enjoy this fragrance i know you've not seen a lot of dents in it because i don't wear it all the time if you look at my back behind me you see a lot of fragrances <laughs> and it's just me and my husband that wears them so some fragrances you can't you may not see a lot of dent but once you see a lot of dent are the ones i really really enjoy wearing that i really really enjoy wearing but doesn't mean i don't enjoy the rest i still do but once i go for is ones i really enjoy a lot yeah summertime i really that was where i got all this then this then to see it was summertime this one is so beautiful it's floral it's citrusy it's spicy not that spicy it's not that spicy but you still get that hint of ginger this one i love it so much and i'm gonna give this one for the rating i'm gonna give this one eight out of ten yes eight out of ten because i enjoy it i love it and the last one yeah i don't have a lot of paris corner i need to i need to i need to get more of it though i have some ma but i just want to separate it i don't want to put ma along with it i want to separate it so <laughs> yes that's why i don't have a lot to show to wait in this video but i'm still going to try and get more of paris corner and the last one is my 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 one of my favorites okay one of my favorites and this one is called river cut this one is inspired by uh baby cats by YSL so if you love baby cats and you can afford it this is another good alternative that you can get this one I believe is below fifty dollars yes below fifty dollars this one is a beast mood it lasts it's spicy it's it's sweet it's woody it gets that pink pepper along it's spicy and they added a lot of spicy olibanum lmi with the pink pepper and the uh cedar wood this one is mm, beautiful and then after wearing this fragrance for some time like um let me say like 
30 to 45 minutes or an hour even with less than that you start getting that sweet rich vanilla which kind of made me fall in love with this fragrance the vanilla mm. beautiful beautiful i enjoy this fragrance so much i get a lot of compliments it's beautiful it's a bit smooth it's long lasting i get a lot of compliments especially for this fall yeah i'm wearing vibe fall vibe <laughs> yes especially for this fall winter and spring oh my god mm. so so sweet it's alluring it's sweet it's it's giving okay if you've not tried this fragrance get it like i said if you love ysl baby cat and you can't afford it this refer cat is another alternative no much difference i'll say no much difference oh, it's a very close very close to baby cat like a younger brother to baby cat beautiful beautiful the spice is not that is not it's the spices and the vanilla and the wood they all blend well they all blend well it's it's giving it's giving and for that i will give this fragrance a 9.5 yes 9.5 <laughs> i love it i love it so much so mm, i would say try and get it if you love spicy um spicy woody kind of incense like incense and vanilla kind of fragrance that is sweet sexual mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes I would say try it. Try it. You will love it. So, friends, thank you so much for staying with me to the end of today's video. Yes, I appreciate you so much. And yes, you that stay to the end of the video, thank you. And also, if you've not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to um, turn on the notification button bell so that you get notified each time i post a video and also if you enjoy my video give it a thumbs up and if you have your opinion like you have something to say about these fragrances or you want to share your opinion or you have a question leave it on the comment section and i will get back to you and also don't forget to share yes share share with your friends your loved ones and before i get out of here um i want to say this i want to ask you this how are you doing i hope you're living life to the fullest i hope you um you surrounding yourself with happy people okay i hope you're doing that and Pray all the time. Pray all the time. Okay. I hope you're doing well. I love you. And I will see you in my next one.